My name is Tiger. I'm a cat. I mostly lay around, play games, and wrestle with my brother Smokey. Yeah, we have it pretty good. So hey everyone, it's Tiger Week, which is the second week in the race for hunger. That means I get my own TV show. I'm calling it a cat mystery because I'm going behind the scenes at Just One More Ministry. Their motto is rescuing food, helping souls. And they get all this donated free food and give it to children, families, and the elderly. They even have cat food. I looked in these giant coolers and found lots of food. I also saw workers and vehicles and a big warehouse. On the computer, I was so happy to see food is up 80% this year to over 2.4 million pounds given away. But after coffee and a cookie, I saw that it also takes money to pay expenses like a mortgage, utilities, insurance, and employees. It's thousands of dollars every single month. So my episode this week is about donors. Donors give us all our food and also all the money that we need to fulfill our mission. So I have two stories. The first one is called Rebel Renovations. John got a really good deal on this building last year because it was an old leather factory. Good old Chris Capper gave a tour back then. The lights didn't even work in some rooms. It took months of hard work before we could even move in. But even then, it wasn't nearly as bright and uplifting as the people inside. These before and after photos wouldn't look nearly as good if it wasn't for generous donations of cleaning, painting, storage racks, and all new lighting that gives us such a nice warehouse today. I met the Kryshak family and they're real nice. They've been giving away backpacks and bicycles for years. And this year, millions of masks. I love the stories on their website. It sure helps us out when generous people like this come along. We're grateful. Here's another good one for you. I call it Lunch Pack and Love. This is about children right here in Milwaukee who found out that other kids didn't have enough food and might be hungry because school lunches were cut back when COVID hit. So they got this idea to make some sandwiches for these hungry kids and color some care notes to go with each sandwich. What a great way to make them feel better and hopefully have a nice day. These photos are just an example of the 90 families that have made 2,200 sandwiches since May. Just One More Ministry has given these sandwiches to shelters and group homes inner city churches, and street outreach. This organization, Kids Impact Community, does all kinds of neat projects. They have a nice website, so check it out. Thanks so much to all the kids and their parents who made sandwiches and drew those great pictures. You guys are the best. Gosh, I sure learned a lot making this video. Especially, why do donors give? Well, they're grateful. Donors look at the good things in their life. Like for me, I have my brother Smokey and a nice house and treats. They're considerate, thinking about others. My backyard is full of animals. They seem to be doing okay. But then I saw a cat in the backyard the other day. 
I wish I got his picture. He was all gray like Smokey. Kind of like this guy. But I was wondering, is he maybe lost and hungry? Because I have plenty to share. Me and Smokey have a lot of cat food. And that's the best thing I learned about donors. They share. They like to. They say it feels wonderful. They seem happy to donate. Wow. Thanks for watching my little movie here. I'm done. Now that you know about donors, maybe you want to be one and help just one more ministry feed Milwaukee's hungry. Just go to our website to donate and make sure you pick the cat to help me win this race for hunger. Pounce on you later.